Hello guys and welcome back to another Hearthstone video today and this is going to be one of those basic Drew decks basically and we're doing like a little mini series where we just do all the basic cards all the basic decks all the best basic decks you can actually get uh, without spending any money for those packs or things like that so yeah this is going to be the Drew deck uh, basic deck uh, just with um, I think it's all the uh, standard cards that you get. I hope I haven't got anything in here. Ah, I've got one card. Is it one card or is it two? I've got one card in here that's a rare. But I think I would usually have um what would I usually have? There's something missing. Oh a Savage in Raw. I'd usually have a sav another a second Savage in Raw. So for this video I'm just gonna take that out and actually put back in the Savage Raw because I managed to get obviously a bit of dust uh, off playing Arena and I created that card because it is actually a pretty good card um, I don't think I've got anything else I'm not sure that's in the standard um, level 10 I'm just gonna have a quick look through yeah sorry about that I should have checked before I started the video but we're going to get into it now anyway. It's a, this is all the star deck stuff. So we got two innovate, overpowered card, gain two mana crystals only for that turn. But if you're on turn two and you chuck, if you got two of these in your hand, uh, you can get out like this guy, which is like ridiculous. Drew of the Claw. I don't think he's in the top. I don't think he is. I think he's actually. I don't think. I think I actually crafted him. Which is a bit unfortunate. I'm not too sure. I'm sorry. I'm just going to keep on going with the video. But you guys can obviously tell me in the de uh, in the description or comments below. Uh, but I do think he's not in the level 10 uh, cards. But I'm sorry if he's not. Uh, basically we've got 2 claw. Uh, give you hero. Plus 2 attack and 2 armor. Just get rid of early game things. Uh, Mark of the world. Give it 2-2 two, two, and taunt. Pretty good card. Nothing much more to say. We've got uh, World Grove, gain an uh, uh, empty mana crystal. Uh, this is really good early game, uh, so you can get more mana crystals than your actual opponent. And we've got two Acidic Swampoos, just, just to get rid of weaponry on them Warrior, Paladin, and Rodex. Next, we've got two Novice Engineer. It's in near enough every one of these decks. Uh, it's just a really, really good two mana card cost card. Uh, you can obviously chuck this down, draw a card, and it could be one of the cards you need. Could not, but it still gives you that plus one. Uh, we've got two River Crocs. Uh, these can become really big with uh, Mark of the World. Um, and some, in some cases, these have been game winners for me. Um, we've got one Mark of the World. Uh, Mark of the World. Mark of Nature. Uh, give a minion four. Four attack or four health and taunt. I usually use it for the four health and taunt. I mean that can be a river croc, which is a two seven taunt card, which is really early, early game. Then we've got two savage raw. Give all characters plus two attack this turn. This is uh, for like late game and um, when you got a few minions on the field and you just want to literally beat down your opponent. Um, because obviously you're going to have plus two on all these other um, minions on the field. Um, plus with the Shatter Sun Clerics as well. With them boosting up other minions. It's even going to be even more damage. Also with the Wolf Riders. Which I've got two of as well. Which I've got, um, which is a 3-1 drop. Um, with charge. So you can just straight hit him in the face. Or get rid of something uh, early game. Um, we've got two Swipes. Uh, these cards. This card is so, so overpowered, it's unreal. I think, in my opinion, anyway. It's really good against Murlocs, uh, because they're near enough got near enough, yeah. I think all, like, one... Most of them have got, like, one health. So, it's a really good card against, uh... uh aggro, uh, Murloc decks. Then you've got Tilda Yeti, we've got two of those. Like I say, he's in most decks as well, because he's just a great four-drop card. Then you've got one Drew of the Claw... Uh, you can either choose a charge, which is 4-4, four, four, or you can turn it into a 4-6 uh, four, four, taunt, which is not too bad. It's a really good card. 
I'd probably have two if I had to, which that's why it makes me think that uh, it's not in the level 10 star deck stuff, so I'm sorry about that. Um, then we've got two star fire. I do a five damage draw a card. What more do you want? You can get rid of a really big, um, really big monster, uh, a really big minion, sorry, uh, off the field and draw a card. It's just like a novice engineer, like a really big novice engineer. Uh, but yeah, a really good card. And then you got two iron beak protectors. These are for late game. This card is good. It's so good. Um, it's, it's really hard to get through. Um, but yeah. This has been the basic druid deck. Hope you guys have enjoyed it. If you did, then please like and subscribe. And peace out.